$4.99. $4.99 for all this print? Should I call your mom and tell her you've gone insane? <laughs> because right now you're actually going crazy. <laughs> welcome home, Rep Back. It's your boy Marcus here, and welcome to Comfort Cartoons, this show where I collect absolutely everything from the late 90s, 2000s, all the way to the modern day. And I'm also trying to create the world's biggest SpongeBob and Nickelodeon collection. And the CEO of this channel is actually the one that gave away Mariah Carey's heart the very next day. She's hardcore. But I hope you guys are having an amazing day, and if you guys aren't, you know the drill. Powdered Toast Man flip? Who is this man of toast? What is his dark secret? Shut up! It's about to get a whole lot brighter about back because your boy is here. And today is one of my favorite days of the quarter, and that is because we get our quarterly subscription box from the Nick Box. This is from Culture Fly and Nickelodeon in collaboration for this amazing box. We open up on the channel all the time. And we've gotten a bunch of different classics, as you see on screen right now, from these boxes to add to the collection. So today we're going to add some other awesome stuff to the collection with our box. But if you guys are new here, how we do this is we are going to compare it to all of these different retailers on screen and what they would typically price this stuff at and see if we can break the total price tag on screen right here of a retail price of 50 bucks. 50 bucks isn't cheap but it's only every three months and almost every single time they double sometimes even triple the value. Let's see if they held up this quarter and what awesome stuff we're gonna be adding to the collection. Anyway let's sit on down. Okay so upon dropping it a couple times I think there might be I hear something ringing. Glass. I hope we didn't break it. Anyway, guys, we got the Nick Fox right here. We have Powder Toast Man at the front. And I did see a little spoiler. There was a Powder Toast Man item in here. And you guys know how much I love Powder Toast Man. One of my favorite characters. The absolute mascot for Ren and Stimpy. So anyway, let's go ahead and check out and see what we got. It is loaded. Let's look for the little booklet that reveals everything. Oh, I don't think that card's in here, actually. Oh, it's in there. It's probably at the bottom. Where's the thing? I have to throw it at Parker. I can't not do that. They actually forgot my card thingy. All right. Well, just imagine I'm throwing something at you. And Ryan, still put the sound effect. Ugh. Doesn't have the same anxiety of you losing your eyes. <laughs> Didn't have the same danger. Yeah, same danger. But either way, we forgot our card, but let's go ahead and check it out and see what we got here. Our first item. Let's see what we got here. We got a pin, and this looks like Sad Clown enamel pin from Rocco's Modern Life. A sad, crying clown in an iron lung. I've always wanted one. So this clip is an episode where Rocco is trying to get this painting right here, and it's a sad clown in an iron lung. The irony. The wordplay. It's the <laughs> juxtaposition, you know, of the two. The saddest thing and the happiest thing. But man, let's take a step back, back into the 50s when drunk clowns were toys for kids. <laughs> so we had a lot of sad clown toys back then, but none of them were in an iron lung. That is sad. But this guy right here will go perfect on the pin board. I'm thinking $7.99. Because we showed the mm -hmm. SpongeBob box, kind of similar pricing. $7.99. 99 on screen. We're already working our way up towards that $50. Unfortunately, like with pins, it doesn't really matter about what it is. It matters about how big. Yeah, about how big it is. And as long as it's just a nice quality image, I mean, pins are just expensive these days. Unfortunately, I mean, they're just glorified stickers that damage your wall. But at least you could use them for a long time. All right, next item out of here. What do we got? Oh. This is an interesting one. It says easel calendar. Oh man, I had a hard old calendar last year. That was a rough year. If this was going to be an easel year, I'll take it. But do you know what an easel is, Parker? I thought I did. That's what you get for thinking you know things. Is it like an art easel where they use like to carry the paint? Uh, I don't know about the easel thing. But we have <laughs> January, which is New Year's. You have February with Valentine's Day. You have March. St. Patty's. Yeah, or light bugs. We have April, which is famous for rain. Also April Fool's. This is dog pee. Then we've got, oh... I like this. This is from the movie when the monkeys actually stole Chucky's glasses, a reference from that, and the giraffe licking Tommy. I mean, he probably thought it was a jawbreaker from Ed and Eddie. And then we've got, oh, this is them at the baseball game. Okay, that ball's been way too quick like your baby to try to catch that. Then we've got <laughs> July. That's famous for Independence Day. It's weird that you did that. I don't know. It's like, yeah, it's, you're correct, but it's just like, we just say the fourth. Yeah, well, you know, I didn't fight any war, so I'm gonna go ahead and just call it what those people did. Shout out to our military, but I'm not gonna take your credit, but I like hot dogs. We got August, where they're watching the Rugrats TV show. This is her coming out of the closet from the intro right here as well. I love all the little references from the episodes. And then also Chucky, he's like, he didn't learn nothing from riding that thing in the beginning. Then we got- Oh, we got a little Timmy Turner appearance, right? <laughs> no, that's, that's Timmy Turner's grades appearance right there. <laughs> F, F, F. And then we have the September, but I don't even know what this is. Oh, school starting. Remind him of that. 
What are you supposed to be, the floating mattress? We got <laughs> Chucky as a ghost over here. A Lil is supposed to be a cow because that's scary. No, they're a tandem cow. Bottom. Oh, but they're separate. <laughs> and then we've got November, which is all about Thanksgiving. Love that little bottle that uh, Chucky's got here. And then also Tommy's classic sippy cup right there and a Reptar plate. And then of course, we have the final one being December right here with the snowball. So I guess how it works is you just put these cards up like that because it's easel, easel, lean. This is one of those things you could definitely put in the collection. It looks pretty nice. I mean, it's better than just put a piece of bunch of papers in here. It's very minimalist. Yeah. I have told you guys before, I'm a maximist. But there are <laughs> minimalists out there that exist. I've heard of them. So if you guys are minimalist, this is definitely going to work for you. All right. So two items right here. The easel, you know that little wood slab they're going to charge you. I know materials wise, it's probably like two bucks. But you know that little wood easel. Easel sounds classy. That sounds like something you eat, have bubbly water next to. But that looks like something that you could just get from like a, a Michaels or like Walmart, you know? But you didn't. So you got you this. Didn't. <laughs> so I'm going to go ahead and say $4.99. $4.99 for all this print? Yes. Just a, you're paying for cardstock. They, it's not like you're paying for the image. They made the image and then just printed it. Should I call your mom and tell her you've gone insane? <laughs> Because right now you're actually going crazy. Because this is ridiculous. This is about five dollars. I'm sorry. Parker's not that well, five. I'll, I'll, I'll be right there. Right. <laughs> like what? Five dollars? And what? What do you live in 1972? I'll go into 7.99. Because I know that these prints right here, they would charge you like three of these on Etsy, be 15 bucks. <laughs> I'm gonna go ahead and say 7.99. So what does that bring us to? A total of uh, 16 bucks. Yeah. So yeah, 16. We're at 16 flat, or or 15.98 if you want to be a Lord Poltergeist about it. All right. Next one we got here. Oh, I like this, dude. We have a wooden cutting board from Angry Beavers. I like that, yeah. You get the idea there because beavers, they chew on wood. <laughs> that did not feel good. But the cutting board for the Angry Beavers, I love the Angry Beavers show right here. This is their Porky the Pig moment, but at the intro where they're actually in their little ring. I love when cartoons do this for the intro for some reason. The Animaniacs did it. Porky the Pig did it. You had that lion from that one intro for those movies that did it. What's up with characters and circles? Ryan, give me a character and circle moment. Back for the new video. All right, I gotta say, I'm gonna give this guy. Is it an actual cutting board, or is that just like actually like a, just a, a plate of wood? You can cut something very small. I mean, you're not cutting no you know smorgage board for ten. <laughs> I'm gonna give this guy because you know that etching right here, you get etching in the back, and this is it could be a coaster too. It's a digital perspective. You can see this is a small cutting board or a really good coaster. I like that. I like that perspective thing. That's gonna that's gonna weigh my uh, price on it. Yeah, I'm gonna go ahead and go with another seven ninety nine on this. So even though I'm, I might not agree with it, I actually can see that in a store. Or as such as box lunch, you go for like $9.99. All right, heads or tails? Heads, $5. Tails, $8. Okay, tails, $9.99. Heads, $7.99. $6.99. You gotta be bigger steaks. You can't even cut a steak on this. Oh God. Tails! That means it's worth five dollars. That right. means it's six ninety nine. I think that's fair and it shows for itself. So I'm gonna give it six ninety nine. And also we'll definitely be putting this on display, but from a distance it just kinda looks like a wood circle. Ooh, what would be good? Oh yes. We put them on this. Absolutely. Now that Got is sick. Yeah, no, 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 that's not sick. That, no, there you go. Yeah. It, it, that's sick. Dang it, Norbert. I told you he'd notice. That is sick right there. That makes for an awesome platform for any angry beaver style items too in your collection. And again, an item you wouldn't get anywhere else. And the Nick Box just makes that perfect item for little accents all over the room, along with some bangers. All right, next one we got here. Oh, oh yes. You, this is after my heart. This oh, is a towel. Yeah, but not just any towel. The, feel this. This is a microfiber. Oh, I You could wash this. your face with this. Uh, yeah, sure. <laughs> I, yeah. Seriously, I am a huge fan of microfibers and we need them all the time around here. So for general dusting in the room, this would be great, but honestly, you already know I'm probably not gonna use it. I was it. like, no way you're gonna use this guy. <laughs> But it has the Reptar there with the Skyline and the Redgrass logo on top. But I gotta say, it kind of gives me like, uh, Ryan would bring the game up on screen. This kind of gives me Rampage vibes. Remember Rampage? The old arcade game where you play as like a lizard named Lizzie? I feel like I do, actually, yeah. Yeah, you probably played as the gorilla, dude. Didn't they make that a movie with The Rock? I don't know if I should be hurt or just sad. That's your reference, a point for that game, yes. Well, yeah, there was a gorilla and then there was like a littler monkey next to The Rock. That was The Rock. <laughs> I had to say that that is an awesome piece though. But let's go ahead and see what we're gonna give this guy. I'm gonna say for a sizable micro like this. There's no way you're giving it above that. No way. You're gonna give it below this woodness? I thought it was just weird that all these stuff is the same. Like maybe $8.99? I was gonna say $8.99. There you go. $8.99 on the screen. We're getting uh, 
how some price is going here. I'm grabbing the small stuff for a reason. We got some Big Mac daddies. No Jake Long in here. But we've got some awesome stuff in here. $34. $34. We're at $34. We are clearing our way to 50. Let's see if we can get some here to get us over to 50. All right, so this one right here I think is gonna get us over, and that is a Ooh. stackable mug. And we've got cat dog and dog that attach to each other. So it's a his and her, or a his and his mine and mine case. <laughs> <laughs> and nobody else gonna drink from it, so it's just mine and mine, and they are not broken. Oh, that's, I was holding my breath on that one. It would never break in oh, this place. <laughs> Me break a mug? Impossible. <laughs> Heart palpitations, inevitable. <laughs> <laughs> All right, guys. So we got the cat one right here, and then we've got the dog right here. So you go ahead and connect those guys just like this. And actually, they stack really well together. Like, I don't feel like there's any like lack of sturdiness there. Cat dog. You couldn't just double dog it. This doesn't even make sense. This one's tea and this one's coffee. I don't know how I like to get my coffee and hand me my Coke. But then not just this, you've got Winslow on the back, number one fan of cat and dog. I gotta say, I have a lot of drinkware, but if you don't have a lot of drinkware in your house, this is a pretty awesome one. I gotta give this guy, this tea set, 15. You know what? I'd give it 15. All right, $15. Let's go and do eight for dog and seven for cat. I'm gonna give eight for dog because Tom Kenny plays them, favorites. All right, so we are at $49. Essentially, we have met our retail value for the box. We've got a couple more items in here. Next up, we've got the big man, the powdered toast man. Now this one, now this is what I was waiting for. This, this guy, is so sick. This guy can't bench. Look at those pecs. <laughs> the toast doesn't push itself out the toaster. The powdered toast man. Oh my gosh, my goodness. Look at the thickness of my the pecs. God. That rib cage is like a community pool. Oh man. Let's just take a look at the glutes. If we compare this figure, like he's very like sleek here. Yeah. But then this one, man, they just went full mass. Okay, so here's what I'm thinking. Like that's like your Marvel Captain America, Chris Hemsworth. That is like Crimson Chin. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. I gotta say, I, I'm a bigger fan of the Kid Robot one. Clearly this one was almost $70. So. Oh, did I get this one for, oh man, this Way box? cheaper. Oh, I'm gonna yeah. go into we have to give this guy at least 20 because of that. Oh, I was gonna, yeah, I mean, I was gonna say at least 20. So. And not to mention, you probably would not be able to get a Powdered Toast Man any other way besides that Powdered Toast Man. There's no other real Powdered Toast Man figures out here. So this one makes a great representation in the collection. I'm gonna give this guy 20 bucks on screen. That's bring easy. us to now 70, essentially. 69, I didn't wanna say it, but, it, but it's there. You said it. He brought it, and I like it. <laughs> All right, next one we got here. Oh, oh my God, this is really cool. This oh. is a, I love this type of vibe for the, especially the winter. And as, as you get older for some reason, you just like cozy things like this. Oh, dude. This is just such a cozy shirt. Like that light gray that just is so warm. It's got a nice soft interior, but not just that, you have this Nick, which was Saturday Night Nick, where they would premiere some of their best shows. And literally it was a perfect day because it's Saturday. You know, we all grew up with Saturday morning cartoons. But you get a nice cozy nighttime vibe with this sweatshirt right there with some of the shows are represented on snake with all that clarissa explains it all are you afraid of the dark and ren and stimpy this one i will definitely be rocking you'll see me wear this i love how simple it is nothing on the back but no hood either i'm gonna That's say 22.99 oh here's my thing because shirt we would give 20 bucks if it was nice enough no we give 25 to shirts sometimes yeah so like i would give it 24.99 but here's my thing i hate like the gray this is not the kind of gray that is bad for a t-shirt t-shirt i get you because you're gonna get the sweat but this is gonna to be an over shirt personal it's a personal thing for me i hate the like aesthetic of like the gray shirts really i just really can't stand i just rather have it on a black and or just even on a white but that gray is so synonymous with like what college you didn't go to like, <laughs> i like it i love the design mm -hmm. i like that it's a sweater i like the quality i hate the color okay i think the color is nice for what kind of vibe is representing but if you're gonna do 24.99 let's just meet at 23.99 on screen which may seem a little high but if you compare that to prices of box lunch t-shirts at a three dollars retail I think a hoodie being 24.99 isn't too far off base I think that's 93 dollars. so that brings to 93 and if we were a little low you might be able to have a couple bucks and you'd be at 100 typically like i said that's what you would expect them to double in value not just that as these boxes get older the items only go up and up i mean for example the cynthia that came out only last year and this guy's going for 70 to 100 dollars already and if you have the cynthia before that it's almost like 200 bucks so the items are truly limited and depending on how 
popular to come down the line. If they make a Brennan Simpy reboot or something like that, and Powder Toast Man is back in the limelight, there's only really two figures, and one of them's in the Nick box. If you guys are a cartoon fan, I highly recommend. I couldn't recommend any subscription box more. Absolutely amazing. But stick around, we're gonna add some of this stuff to the collection. But you guys know the drill. Scan it! Okay, and for a pin, I'm gonna, of course, put all the backboards. I'm not gonna show you guys this every single time, but just know whenever we put a pin, I always put all the back cards right here in this bag with all of our back cards from every single pin that we've gotten so far. But I love the gold backside on this one. Let's go ahead and add this one. Okay, I'll do this one random, all right? Aha ta ta! Ha! I'm sure that wasn't random. <laughs> <laughs> all right, random. Ha! That is a little more random. Yeah, so right there in the middle, we have that blank space there. We have the sad clown in an iron lung. Pin board is still adding up. I love the pin board. It's gonna take us a long time to get that thing filled, but we'll have another episode coming out that'll help us fill up a little bit more. Okay, and for Powder Toast Man, you guys probably could have figured we put him right back here with, with this whole Powder Toast Man section with all the Brennan Stimpies. And then for Norbert and Daggett, of course, I had to put them on the wood plank that we got there. I just think that's too cool of a base. Looks a little weird with the snow right now, but we're getting close to the end of the year. All right, guys, but we got one more thing here we haven't tried on the Snick sweater. Let's go ahead and do it. A one, a two, a skiddly diddly do. And boom. I gotta, I gotta admit, it's a little snug. No, 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 Snick. Oh. Snick, it sounds better than Snug, I guess. But this thing is awesome. I also didn't notice the Nick Box logo down here. It is super cozy. I already feel the temperature rising in here. I love it. But I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you guys did, make sure you smack that like button, subscribe if you're new here, and also check out this video on your screen right here, which is the last epic video on this channel. I know you guys are gonna love it. I'll see you guys over there, and once you get on there, I'll put you on a playlist of all the Nick Boxes so far so you can enjoy all the surprises they've had in store for us. I'll see you guys over there. Again, make sure you subscribe for this next video. It's gonna be amazing. And as always, Rep Pack, I'll see you beautiful people in the next one. Adios. Boop.